Hi, my name is Josh Friedis. I'm the Executive Director of Equal Rights Washington, Washington State's lesbian, gay, bisexual, and transgender civil rights organization. Since I don't know how to edit a video, I'm going to try to do this in just one take. Some people are asking, why should we vote this year? I want to tell you it's every bit as important as voting last year when we voted to uphold Washington State's domestic partnership law by approving Referendum 71. Over the last several years, the Washington State Legislature has voted a number of very, very important bills into law. These include the anderson Murray Anti-Discrimination Law, three domestic partnership laws, the Healthy Youth Act, and two safe schools bills, a bill adding gender identity and expression to the state's hate crimes law, and the list goes on. But we're at risk of losing the equality-minded majority in the Washington State Legislature if you don't vote for equality-minded legislators. So that's what we need to do this year. We need to vote, and we need to tell our friends and family members to vote for equality-minded legislators. In addition, there are a large number of measures on the ballot that could cripple the state's ability to fund critical programs like HIV, services and prevention, and a couple of measures that could help. I want to highlight two measures. The first is Initiative 1098, which Equal Rights Washington is endorsing. This measure would provide critical funds for health care and education, and we're particularly grateful to the authors of 1098 for making sure that it was fully inclusive of registered domestic partners. The other measure I want to highlight is Initiative 1053. It's a Tim Iman initiative, and we're urging voters to vote no on 1053. Tim Iman, you may remember, is the person who tried to repeal in 2006 the anderson Murray anti-discrimination law. You can rest fairly assured that any time Tim Iman puts something on the ballot, you want to vote no. But this one is particularly problematic because it could result in the slashing of AIDS, HIV, services and prevention programs and other critical programs in Washington state. What can you do? Well, first of all, when you get your ballot, vote to find out who is an equality-minded legislator. You can go to the Progressive Voters Guide online, or you can go to the Equal Rights Washington website, where you will find our endorsements. Thank you so much, and we look forward to seeing you vote and telling your friends and family to vote in this critical election year. There's a great deal at stake.